Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to A Hat in Time. In the last part, well, we picked up a new hat, way down at the bottom here, the Time Stop hat, which his ability is... makes everything weird colored for a little bit. And then, that actually is a pretty slow, and that is with the speed up for a recharge. In this part, we are going to be... Oh, we also completed the Sleepy Subcon, got all those uh, parts, much like the... Um, Purple Time Rift here, the Mafia of Cooks. We are headed to Cheating the Race. We are racing this Mafia who is riding a giant firework. It is going to be an interesting race, to say the least. He seems very um, confident of his victory. And there's the course. We go through most of the game. Well, most of the Mafia town, about half of it, really. So. We can talk to this guy. It looks like our lighting engine's having an issue again. Mafia on rocket. Mafia is fast. Fastest man alive. Indeed, Mafia. Indeed. So. Child, want to race fastest man alive? Mafia stole timepiece from HQ. If you win, Mafia give it to you. So that's basically the um thing behind this race. You can win it without the time stop hat, but the game expects you to have the time stop hat to do this. So it wasn't unlockable, like it wasn't doable until theoretically right now. So I, I got the time stop hat. I don't trust myself on the scooter well enough. So we are going to race him. It is on! Mafia not sure Mafia survived this, but at least Mafia die as fastest man alive! A solid strategy, dying as the fastest man alive is not necessarily a bad thing. Yeah, I'm starting to feel like one of the engines didn't quite load here, but I mean, it does make everything bright. So yeah, we can just kind of stop time and walk past him. Do, 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 do. And basically every time it recharges, I'm just going to load it again. Because you can see he's flying off routes we don't even get. Look at this. We got hit, so that ended our... I don't think we're making this. Yeah, he beat us there, and then he kills us. So we are going to give this another shot, because clearly we messed something up here. There's probably a very fast way we can do this, and this was not it. So... Alright, it is on. Let's see if he dies the fastest man alive. Get ready. Go. Oh. Be careful not to double push it. Oh. Because if you double push it, he gets a huge uh, boost on you, I guess. Yeah, there's gotta be something I'm missing about this race. Cause. Yeah. So we can get a lot of speed downhill, it looks like. Uh, but uphill, he's got us beat for sure. One more try, and then I will just cut to what should be the successful attempt. Though I hate that my shift button is so small on this one. Shift and control are my two tiny buttons on here. Get ready. Go. So if you crash or anything, he's he's gonna get a speed boost on you. Oh, yeah, that's just me hitting the the wall is what's the issue here. He beat us there again. I I think I might actually try with the scooter because I'm not getting this one very well. But you guys will will see the successful attempt when it happens. Uh, it's an unfortunate one for right here. Uh -huh. 
All right, one more try. Let's go, go, go. Get ready. Two, one, go. go. Because yeah, I definitely should be doing this faster than I am already. There's no just retry option, so that's not the best. Yeah, he's won already. I'm gonna actually take a look at my settings, see if I can controls, change that around. Um Settings uh, Like I, I wanna change my controls. Is that not an option? Oh, controllers. That was scary looking. I guess there's no changing my controls. This reminds me of those, um, what are they? The Koopa races that we're getting in Odyssey. They are rather annoying and there's like one correct way of doing it. I'm just not knowing that. Uh, let me double check my badges. We have the Fast Hatter reduces cooldown. You don't really need this. No more bonking against walls uh -huh. while diving. Let's do that. Because see if the no bonk badge is enough to save us. Because when we bonked, we kept losing. Um, we lost a lot of stuff from just bonks. And so if that bonks are just gone now, I think we've got a better chance. Like this, this looks like it's, it's going much better. Who would have guessed? It was just, don't bonk. Yeah, so that was the solution. Use the no bonk badge. And that is Mafia Town all clear. So I'm probably not cutting anything out because it was only, I think, one that I would have cut out in that. So I probably won't be cutting anything out of this episode. Um, we finish up Mafia Town now. Uh, what's left is, I believe, just the Alpine Skyline. I'm going to go back over there and double check, because we're missing one too many for it to just be the Alpine Skyline, is my thoughts. Have we gone through here? Oh, well, let's change our hats and check. Because I'm not sure what the last one is, because we'll have the two blue rifts from the Skyline, plus the purple. Um... I see I have two. I guess maybe we haven't done this one? Well, we'll check next time. Thank you all for watching A Hat in Time, and in the next part, we find the missing time rift we didn't do on the spaceship. Because I know there's the mail room, there's this one, and then there's the gallery. So there should be three on the spaceship, we only have two. So one of them is here. See you guys then.